whatever you do, don't push this button because that will start the ceremony and Mark and Megan are not here yet. Now, repeat back what I just said. I am Groot. Uh-huh. I am Groot. No, that's exactly what you just said. How is that even possible? Hey, you're making him nervous. Shut up and give me some tape. I want to put some tape over the show button. Nobody has any tape. Not a single person has tape. You have an atomic bomb in your bag. If anybody has any tape, it's you. I have to do everything. You are wasting a lot of time here. That's a really bad sign. It's showtime, teachers. Alan, he always has to make some sort of entrance. That's right. That's it. We all remember a really special teacher, right, who made an impression on all of us, inspiring us, uh, making school a really memorable experience. Well, tonight, we are honoring the 12 outstanding ABC 10 teachers of the month. Outstanding teachers not only inspire, they motivate the children to achieve greatness, not only in the classroom, but also in the real world. Uh Today we celebrate the decades long career of Miss Vanessa Dotry. Who can tell me something about vowels? Vanessa Dotry was a kindergarten teacher at H. Allen Height Elementary School in Natomas. When I look at my students, I think of them as my own children and I want them to reach their highest potential. Longbow, you says. She has been teaching for 34 years. This will be her last as she plans to cross over into the retirement world at the end of the year. We learn lots of stuff, reading books. We just celebrated a child in my room who went from reading nine words a minute to 58 in seven weeks. For more than three decades, she has gone above and beyond to ensure all of her students succeed. When I get letters from kids who used to roll on the floor and take their tennis shoes off and then they write me a letter and say, I am now a teacher because of the things that you said to me, be a leader, not a follower. That's what makes this my last year of teaching so rewarding. For $1,000. Vanessa, I wish you had been my teacher. Right. Things would have been so much different. Congratulations, <laughs> Vanessa Dotrieve of H. Allen Height Elementary School in Natomas. I present you with an apple that'll last a lifetime. Only a select group of people would actually put two words, fun and math, together in a sentence. But the students of our next teacher, Sarah Lopez. Oh. There they are. Sarah has a fan base. I like that. Uh, say it all the time because according to them, that is exactly what Miss Lopez does. Makes math fun. Take a look. Does anyone know what one and a half plus one and a half is? Sarah Lopez has been teaching at Diamond Creek Elementary School in Roseville for 11 years. Ms. Lopez currently teaches fourth grade. She started out teaching first and second graders. I wanted to work and influence children and be a part of their everyday lives and help their education and problem solve and reach their own potential. Your group can come up and share what you buy and why. She is encouraging and hands-on and parents say she has respect for each individual student. I understand that every student has their own way of learning and that's why like when we're doing math or anything I have multiple children share their different answers so they can hear different ways of learning. Her class of 34 students responds well to her teaching style. Unlike other teachers, she actually made me like math. Close! You're inches! And that is why Ms. Lopez is ABC 10's Teacher of the Month. Congratulations to Sarah Lopez, yes, our June 2016 Teacher of the Month from Diamond Creek Elementary School in Roseville. As you know, <laughs> Spanish is the second most spoken language in America. 
and the most spoken language in the classroom of our July teacher, as okay. it happens. Can I pause you right there? See. Si. Um, Mark has a really good Spanish accent. See. Si. Si. Oh, muy bien. Señorita bonita. I'm Chiquita. done. I'm spent. That's all Chiquita. I got. Okay. <laughs> but that goes this well teacher spent. could probably help me out. Well, the yeah. uh, teacher of the month is Lucy Zamora. Cadena alimenticia. Vamos a aprender sobre. Lucy Zamora teaches a first grade Spanish immersion class at Walnut Grove K through eight school in Patterson. Fifty percent of the time, it's in Spanish. They'll have me for half of the day, and then they'll go with the other teacher, and then they'll learn in English. Fifty percent of the day. It's good to have two languages. All of her students will go on to be fluent in both English and Spanish, a valuable skill. My dad only speaks English, but my, my mom speaks Spanish and English. When students are asked why they enjoy her class, there was a common theme. Because she does tons of activities, a lot of activities. I live, breathe education like I, it's my passion. Basically, I want my kids to love learning. I try to make it as engaging as I can. For the past 14 years, that's what she's done. I just found out that I got a position as a principal now. Her engaging lesson plans, passion for teaching, and influence on young minds are just a few of the reasons Lucy Zamora is ABC 10's Teacher of the Month. So great job, Lucy Zamora, ABC 10's July 2016 Teacher of the Month from Walnut Grove, K-8 in Patterson. Congratulations. Thank you. Yes, good Como, luck. Como esta? Muy bien. Uh, estoy bien, gracias. ¿Y usted? Muy bien. Nerviosa, sí. Sí, sí. Okay. sí. Megan taught me that just now. So happy. Uh, for almost two decades, Wendy Aiello has been inspiring young minds to achieve in the classroom. It is her caring ways that her students say mean so much to them. Good morning, Sydney. Wendy Aiello currently teaches third grade at Diamond Creek Elementary School in Roseville. I love children. I spent 20 years in early childhood education, and I've been in public schools for about 18 years now. And Every day is different. Every day is a surprise. Read the directions. I feel like I need to get to know my students and assess their strengths and their weaknesses and then really um, encourage their strengths. For students at this age, reading skills are a critical part of their education. And we know that they need to be reading by third grade pretty fluently to be successful. And I've had some huge breakthroughs with kids where you can see their light bulb go on and they're proud of themselves. And her students say she makes reading fun. She's nice, caring, and she makes us like do fun art. Her passion for teaching and care for her students is what makes Wendy Aiello ABC 10's Teacher of the Month. A thousand dollars. What? Whoa. what? Wendy Aiello Diamond Creek Elementary School in Roseville. Come on down. Congratulations. Congratulations. Thank you. I am good. Uh-huh. I am good.